Alright guys, so I'm gonna show you my um, home theater sub system and I'm using a car amplifier with this power supply that I got I got off of Amazon and it's powering an old school Rockford Fosgate uh, HX2 10 inch in a ported box and so uh, let me show you guys this wire this is uh, running off of uh, my home theater system and it's a J an old school JVC surround sound system so that's where the uh, sounds coming from the JVC to the MTX the MTX is bridged oops it's bridged so it's pushing around 300 watts RMS to the sub and uh, and of course here you have the uh, power wire going to the um, power supply uh, here's the ground again going to the power supply and then I have a uh, small wire hooked up from the positive lead to the uh, remote start wire or part of the amp and uh, to power the amp the I'm sorry to power the power adapter power supply I used a um, one of these power plugs that belongs to a computer cut the end of it and if you can see there's a brown a green and a striped green and yellow wire I actually had to look that up online a little diagram to tell me which one's power and which one's um, negative and all that stuff but uh, it, it was easy to figure out so again this is my sub home um, audio theater system sub system and it's a car amplifier MTX Thunder 282 old school powering an old school Rockford Fosgate HX2 and this amp is being pushed or powered I'm sorry by the uh, amplifier and I'll put that in the video I'll write that in there and uh, you let's take a listen